Norman of CCTN here with a major breaking story. The new purple recycling program goes into effect today. That's right, folks, to go along with our existing blue, red, orange, gray, brown, yellow, and burgundy bin programs, the Purple Bin Campaign is making sure we keep our city super clean and environmentally friendly. Superintendent McClellan has personally guaranteed this campaign will be the most environmentally... And one of the things we don't do when taking our driving test is listen to the radio. I'm sorry, ma'am, I forgot to turn it off. I'm a little nervous, it's my second time. Just pull behind this car. What you got? Got a load of purple bins? Send me to the wrong place, though. This is the toxic waste dump. Oh, no mistake. I'm supposed to take one load of purple bin recyclables per day and every day from here on in. So wheel your rig around and start dumping. You mean I'm supposed to put all that good recycling stuff into this green gunk? Orders direct from City Hall. What is in this stuff, anyway? No idea, friend, no idea at all. Hey, 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 you're cutting it too close! got a special exciting message from City Hall. Ever wonder what to do with those drinking boxes you use and other things you don't know where to put? Well, here's the answer. It's the Purple Recycling Bin Program. And that's why this new Purple Bin campaign is doing wonders for our public image. Superintendent McClellan, I still don't know about all this. I mean, do we already have six or seven different colored bins already? I mean, I don't even know what goes in what half the time. And I'm Mayor Mel. I just hope no honest, hard-working, capital city citizen is confused by all this. No! Papers, plastic. What is that? It feels like paper, but it's a kind of a paper can. It's infuriating. Does it go into red? Does it go into blue? Ah! Why so upset, Lucy? Oh, it's these blockheads who run the city. Do they think I have time for sorting, sorting, sorting? I have things I must do, you know. Plans to make. Things which I... Uh, Miss Gore, what are you wearing? Oh, there's a whole bunch of old movie costumes in that trunk back there. 
You know, you might have a look yourself. Your wardrobe could do with a little spicing, too. I need no spicing. I have no time for spicing. I only have time for that which I'm about to unleash on this city of do-gooders and recyclers. Which reminds me, did you get me those plans I asked you for? Schematics for the Heinegger Hole, toxic waste dump, just like oh, you asked. Oh, wonderful. The last detail of my latest diabolical and ingenious plot. <laughs> Klaus, you've had me running around all week stealing schematics for the city's power grid, the phone system, the water system, and now this toxic waste dump. But you still haven't let me know what you're up to. You want to know what I am up to, Miss Gore? <laughs> Only the most ingeniously, fiendishly clever plot which will spell doom for those infuriating monster warriors forever! And the best thing, they won't even know they're in a trap until long after. <laughs> <laughs> you should laugh, it's good, it feels good. <laughs> but every weekend spent going through every junk store and garage sale in all of Capital City. No junk, no weapons. I want to drive back to the HQ. I need to get in all the practice I can. And I swear my last driving test wasn't my fault. I don't know. I mean, the law of probabilities would suggest that not everyone's cut out for their driver's license. Tanya, how'd you like the CD player jammed down here? Guys, it's with the store lights. Lights blinking on and off? Another power crisis? I don't know. You know, usually when something like this happens, it's monster related. <laughs> Guys, we have company. PayPal, I'm just gonna drive. Luke, is that a. like we got some new residents in Capital City. Folks, Dink Dorman here with an emergency CCTN news report. Capital City appears to be the victim of random acts of sabotage. Water mains are down. Transit trains inoperative. Phone lines are down. Traffic and all sorts of other lights gone kerflooing. Kerflooing? Yes, kerflooing. On top of that, eyewitnesses report that strange skeleton creatures are lurking near the site of each attack. Starting with, first... Capital City toxic waste site at Henninger Hole. All of Capital City is asking the same thing. Where will these little devils strike next? It's gotta be Von Steinhauer again. I wouldn't be so sure. None of these creatures fit in with any of his previous recreations. Giant squid, giant spider, dragon. These are all very large creatures. Then it does make sense. He's smart. He's figured out that big monsters doing big things just isn't working. So, he switched his tactics. Well, if we're gonna whip these little guys, we gotta start from the beginning. Where's that? Well, you heard the radio. First place the skeletons were sighted, toxic waste site down behind her hole. With the traffic lights down, it'll take forever. Don't worry about it, I know a few shortcuts. One way or another, I'm getting my license. I'll drive. Um, skeletons are one thing. Be quiet back there. What a surprise! The monster warriors in their little purple car are making their way to Heinego Hall. Mm, sorry, warriors. My plan is already ten steps ahead, and by the time you catch up, it will be too late. <laughs> Ease up on the gas and gently on the brake. Luke, I know what I'm doing. That's my dad's truck. I wonder what he's doing here at the toxic waste dump. Let's find out. Just having a little trouble with the whole. 
whole parking thing, okay? Daddy? Hey, Tabby Cat. Uh, didn't you hear? The whole downtown's going kerflooey. Yeah, I know. I'm on my way. But first, I had to do an emergency safety check on this place. And after all, if one of these tanks went up, this could be a real danger zone. Why is that, sir? Well, this used to be Capital City's water treatment facility before it was converted. See all this old piping? All you have to do is crank one of these valves. You'll empty everything that's in these tanks right into the town's main water supply. Scary, huh? I've been after City Hall to fix it for years, but they tell me they need a full study. Full study. What they really need. Full suede here. Yep, I'm on it. Look, I gotta run. Something's tripped the train signals four blocks down. Bunch of books on anatomy at the library that just might. Where's Vanka? Driver's test. Again? Yeah, she figures that with the town so distracted by the city falling apart, she might actually stand a chance. And Luke? He said he had private business. Come on, I contacted you before. I just. Luke? It's you, you're there. Um, it's about the skeletons. Do you know about the skeletons? Be careful, Luke. Luke. They fought well. What can you tell me? There's a whole bunch of things I'd love to tell you, but I can't, can't. It would wreck your, your time timeline. My timeline? What does that mean? Did you say timeline? We're all fans of the monster warriors. Your heroes to all of us, to all of us. You fought well. Fought? Did, did you say fought? I'll help. But I have to be careful with the timeline, Luke. So do you mean to tell me you're from... Future? But if you're from the future and you say we fought, does that mean the battle's over? Did we win or lose? Uh, Tabby just perfected her laser invention. Panic still continues to build, folks, as one by one, Capital City power structures are weakened. Weakened, but not destroyed, Mr. Dorman. And for that eventuality, I'm going to need CCTN's help. The new station's help? Yes, my dear. For a plan that I intend to set in motion right now. What are you up to, Klausi? <laughs> I was just about to parallel park when you won't believe what jumped right into my line of sight. A skeleton? I was so startled, I stepped on the gas instead of the brake again. So how'd you do? I can take the test again next week. <laughs> Did you see anything else unusual? Most people have just locked themselves in their homes. The rest are expecting the attack of the skeleton army. Maybe that's what is going to happen. What do you mean? I don't know. I just, I can't help but feel like everything that's happened so far is just some sort of buildup, like the worst is yet to come. And even if we do manage to stop them, is that going to be enough? I mean, they're already skeletons. I should fix that trigger mechanism. Folks, this is an emergency news flash from Dink Dorman. The skeletal creatures are reported in the vicinity of the CCTM broadcast building. That means that can only... What? I can't operate the camera. Let me go. Oh. Oh, not the face, my livelihood. Oh. <clears throat> Citizens of Capital City, we are now in complete control. Do not try to resist. Return to your homes, stay there to await further instruction. I repeat, stay in your homes. What do you think it means? Doesn't make sense. Why are they telling everybody to stay in their homes? I know. 
Remember what my dad said about those old pipes out at Hunninger Hall? Sure. He said they could easily be connected to the city's water supply. Oh, wow. All the sabotage. It's just been a big scare tactic. They've panicked everyone in Capital City into staying in their own home. And now they're gonna pump each home full of toxic waste from the toxic waste dump. Oh, man. We got trouble. Get your gear, guys. It's monster time. Warriors, but you cannot defeat my skeleton warriors. Oh, they are my greatest creation. They are beautiful, deadly. They're not from any movie you created, Klaus. So where'd you get the idea? Well, uh... Open the tanks. We gotta move fast. Slice and dice time, guys. I got this one. It's like they can anticipate our every move. We gotta do something. Maybe. You fought well. I'd love to help you, but I can't. That's it. Do what we wouldn't do. What? Put down your guns and back away. Because we're not fighting like we're supposed to. On the count of three, pick up your weapons and fire. One, two, three! Take this guy down. Vanka, we can't! I'll take that. Uh, <laughs> guys? Who says I can't parallel park? smashed into bits! Oh. oh, I will never use small, normal-sized creatures again in my plans. No! Giant creatures from now on! Yeah, if I ever start talking about small creatures again, stop me. Hmm? Sure I will. Come on, Klausi. Let me get you some tea. Mm. You're a nice lady. That must be my dad and the rest of the fire department on their way. Are you okay, Luke? Yeah. Yeah, I'm okay. It's just... That wasn't easy, was it? No kidding. They were the toughest to fight of all so far. They were fast, inventive, fought brilliantly as a team. Kind of like... Us. Too much like us. the purple bin campaign an unnamed official at city hall said quote the whole thing is too complicated and confuses too many people 
elsewhere, Superintendent McClellan assures CCTN that any suggestion of a connection between the Purple Bin campaign and the skeletons who attacked the city is purely coincidental. <laughs> so I figure if we take the CD player and cross-charge it with this... I got it. Your license? Yep. You mean you finally mastered the basic physics and telemetry of parallel parking? It's simple. You just focus your energies like the future of Capital City rests on you putting the car in the right place, and you got it. It's awesome. Thanks. Nice. Do you want to know? Yes. No. OK. See, a friend once told me that time isn't like one giant river. It's more like a zillion tiny little streams running alongside each other. So if it is possible... Maybe you should just ask me. Where are you, Henry? Capital City. When in Capital City? The future. What's it like? It's bad, Luke. Really bad. Why? The monsters of one, Luke. The monsters of one.